What if I told you there was a player who was ranked number one in the world, and after just three games in college, one decision nearly ruined his life forever? This is the story of James Wiseman. It all started back in 2017, when the University of Memphis came down on coach Penny Hardaway accusing him of major offenses involving James. And once those rumors started making headlines, it immediately forced the NCAA to announce that James would be banned from being able to play for Memphis only after one game. Breaking news on CBS Sports HQ, the NCAA has ruled on James Wiseman. He'll be suspended 12 games. And that's when his chances of making the NBA were canceled. And to make the situation even worse, once an investigation was put into place, what they found nearly got him banned from basketball. You see, the investigators found proof of Hardaway's payment of $11,500 to the family. And even though Memphis said Wiseman had no knowledge of it happening, the NCAA didn't care. This was serious. But why was it such a big deal to the NCAA? Well, at the time of the payment, Hardaway was a coach at Memphis East High and had just donated $1 million to the University of Memphis to build a sports hall of fame. But because James was playing for Penny back in high school, the NCAA felt that the $11,500 check was a bribe to get James to continue playing for Hardaway in college later down the line. And all because Penny made that million dollar donation. He was labeled a booster, making his payment to the Wiseman family a violation of NCAA rules. And since James came to play for Memphis instead of Kentucky, who was also recruiting him, it looked like a very suspicious situation, forcing the university to hit James with a severe penalty of a 12-game suspension, missing weeks of the season ultimately forcing the Wiseman family to donate the payment of $11,500 to a charity of their choosing. But things only got crazier from there, because on the same day, the judge granted Wiseman a temporary restraining order against the NCAA's ruling in order to allow him to keep playing. But only two hours later, James had his lawyers file a lawsuit against the NCAA to try and restore his eligibility. And even though the suspension was temporarily resolved because of this, James quickly realized no course of action was going to progress him towards getting back onto the court. Now being forced with the hardest decision of his life, James was wishing upon a star at this point, tearing up most nights, not being able to play for his team. And all he wanted was to make a name for himself and accomplish the dream of going into the NBA. But the NCAA didn't care. They had made their decision and they were sticking to it, forcing James to miss seven games of the 12 during the season. But eventually he realized he was worth so much more than college, announced he was leaving Memphis to hire an agent and prepare for the 2020 NBA draft. With the second pick in the 2020 NBA draft, the Golden State Warriors select James Weissman from the University of Memphis. Now, I don't know what's crazier, being banned from an entire league or you. Yeah, you, clicking this video right here.